lovers, YouTubers, and hair lovers. It's your girl, Global Curls, coming at you with day six of eight days and eight products with Up North Naturals. So if you haven't seen day one, two, three, four, or five, please go ahead and do so because you've missed some great information. I've given you tips. I've told you all about the five out of the eight products that I've received from Up North Naturals so far, the ingredients found in them, and what they do for your hair. So please go ahead to my YouTube channel, First of all, subscribe and then go ahead and watch the channels. But enough of that today, like I said, it's all about day six product. And it's something a lot of you have been asking about. And it is the Up North Naturals. See the eyeshadow matches the label? Isn't that cool? Mm -hmm. <laughs> the day six curl e styling lotion by Up North Naturals. Again, it's eight ounces. This is what it looks like. It has a nice little pump handle to do the lotion. It says for naturally curly hair. We already knew that. And we also know from all the other videos that the Up North Naturals brand is made up with 100% all natural ingredients. And so the ingredients found in this one is rose water, aloe, and grapeseed oil. Now I've already reviewed these three ingredients, so I'm not going to go ahead and bore you again with them. But if not, feel free, they're right here for you so you can see the ingredients and what they do for your hair. Now I'm just going to go ahead and run into the review part of this. So review time with the Curl E Styling Lotion. Now a lot of you have been asking the styling lotion, how was it? Now I have to say two things. First, I'm going to preference what I'm going to say in a couple minutes by saying that I actually haven't tried the Curl E Styling Lotion alone. Remember you guys voted on my Insta story, you wanted to see a different style, I asked and you guys voted for the Flexi Rod set, which is what I did, which is the result of how my hair looks right now. So I didn't use this by itself like I would have. However, Sunday tomorrow, I will be doing just that. My regular wash and goes, I will be using the Curl E Styling Lotion as a holder. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and read the back for you guys so you can understand it a little bit more. It easily glides through your curls for lasting shine and definition. So directions, here it says, for best results, use after the go-to hair milk, which we talked about earlier yesterday, and the eight oil blend, if you didn't watch that video, that was a really good video with some great key information for you. So make sure you go ahead and watch that. On freshly washed hair, apply a generous amount, smooth down, air dry, pick and fluff at the roots, so on and so forth. So I'm actually going to be using it just how it says. You can use this and as a light hold exactly what it says so for all my maybe you know 1a to 3c girls maybe 4a you can use this as a light hold and not put anything else in it however if you have thicker hair or you want a tighter hold you'll just follow it up with the next couple of products that they talk about which is the edges smoothing gel which they have um, and also a couple other ones to make sure your hair is held into place. The twist and curl butter is absolutely phenomenal too. I'll be talking about that later, but that's also a good product to follow up with this after you've used it. So what I will say about this is that I like what it did to my hair from what I can tell. Again, I did the flexi rod set, so I definitely used the curl and ease butter after this to hold it thoroughly. But when I did apply this, I noticed that, first of all, it's a light hold, so I'm just gonna go pump it for you to show you what it looks like. And this is what it looks like. It's very, has a very light slip to it. Um, does smell good, but you probably already knew that because of the rest of the product smell good as well. And so what I liked about the curl ease is that it gave my hair a lot of hold without making it crunchy and I'm just putting the extra in my hair right now but it gave my hair a lot of hold without making it crunchy normally sometimes even with curl ease like a styling lotion even if it says styling lotion on the product sometimes it leaves your hair quite crunchy not only crunchy feeling but crunchy looking and that's not something you want especially it's not something that I want so what I found is that the curl e styling lotion actually was a light hold now when I say a light hold I really mean a light hold do not only use this if you're looking for a little bit something extra I would definitely go ahead and recommend you doing some type of gel or following up with the twist and curl butter but if you're looking for a light hold to get a lot of volume but make sure your curls are fine then this is definitely a good product I the only thing I would say as a con is that it's not 
as tight of a hold as I would like it to be. However, I'm going to keep it honest. I always keep it honest with you guys. I did enjoy the hold that it provided. It didn't make my hair crunchy. It didn't look crunchy. My hair still felt soft afterwards. Um, I will definitely be using this, like I said, tomorrow to go ahead and just do my wash and goes, my normal routine. I won't be doing any type of flexi rod being too set. Um, that was strictly for you guys. But this was a good the styling lotion was a good one to have um, and I did like it. So that's my review on the styling lotion. Make sure you keep up to date because tomorrow is day seven. So we only have two more days, guys. I'm getting really sad. We only have two more days left so I can show you all of the full range of products that I received from Up North Natural. So I hope you guys have been liking these videos. If so, please A, subscribe to my channel, B, like, three, comment, and four, share with your friends because I give you guys a lot of great information and I would love your feedback. All right, guys. Peace out. I will see you tomorrow.